We've assembled to discuss the intelligent use of drugs. <laughs> An ayahuasca ceremony is intense. That's what it's like when you're attempting to heal your heart, to connect back to your lost soul. She comes through in a way which helps us to see what the message is. These little fractures of our ego get dropped off slowly. And that's through what we call an ego death. Most people are denying and resisting the medicine journey because they're scared of themselves. A lot of energy and effort and love from the shaman's heart to going into this brew. And I certainly had the feeling that these shaman were totally invested in helping everyone in that room get what they call is their miracle. And the more you're around the medicine and the more you understand the visions, the more you can learn to see the message within the vision. Oh, what a night. For someone that cried for three hours straight, <laughs> she's in a very good mood. After the first night, I was thinking, what else could I be able to heal? Everything happened for me in night one. She's coming to get you. But your mama's gonna get you.